Acting Premier Panyaza Sufi has announced his new cabinet. Nomantung Komora Lehoko has been appointed the new health and wellness MEC. Lesufi says the name change includes wellness, which will emphasize the physical well-being of patients. He says the province's health care sector must be overhauled to better serve residents. In our consultations with members of the Executive Council, the ANC was also very firm on what kind of a team they want. And they send a strong message to the Premier that there must be no compromise on competency and skills. There must be no compromise on gender parity. And you will see the team we are going to release will have more women than men on the basis of the firm commitment that the ANC gave us. The ANC said we must appoint leadership that is beyond reproach, that is not attached to scandals, leadership that is clear, and leadership that does not have questionable characteristics. We are investing a lot in information management at that particular level. Uh, we want to reduce the queues. Uh, we want to reduce. You'll see when we proceed on other areas that we are intervening. So the wellness component uh, will also have a strong regulatory arm. There's a kind of food that are circulating, in, fake food that are circulating in the market. We want to regulate that. We want to tackle that. Uh, the food that is expired and people are selling it in there. So we are strengthening the wellness part of it, the regulatory wellness of it, where people are not keeping to standards. They're increasing the level of sugar, the level of salt, and all those particular things. So that is why now we want to elevate uh, the wellness part of it in terms of health. Uh, but the education part of it, uh, what is TB, what is cancer, within the schooling environment, so that our children know the food that they must eat, healthy food, and food that is not healthy. But because health is under tremendous pressure in our province, um, senior clinicians want to leave. You are quite aware what has happened in Temisa Hospital. So we need a senior leader in the ANC to be deployed there and take that responsibility on our behalf. And within that context, we have appointed the deputy chairperson of the ANC, Nomantu Nkomoralu Huku, to be the new MEC for health and wellness. Faith Mazibuko has retained her position as Gauteng Community Safety MEC, while Jacob Mamabolo has been moved from transport to finance. We are serious in the fight against crime. We can't surrender our future to criminals. Uh, and that's why we are putting uh, this kind of interventions. And the law enforcement agencies is, is going to play a critical role. And we've asked a no fear person to lead it, Comrade uh, Faith Mazibu, uh, to lead us in the fight. We can't have kidnappings uh, just happening or, or, and that is why the helicopter component. You can't just have people robbing uh, cash in transit in the middle of a freeway uh, and nothing happens to them. Uh, we want to enter that space and push back. If we can fight crime in Gaudi, we would have saved South Africa the tech of being a crime destination or a, a, an area where tourists are killed and other things. So we're going big on this one. That is why is part of our uh, 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 budget movement. So we're going to move lots of budget in the, in the, in, in the fight uh, against crime. We want to reclaim back all the Spanza shops that are not owned by South Africans, and we're not apologetic about it. We want to fund South Africans that will open their own stores. We want to fund South Africans uh, that will ensure that those shops are owned by South Africans. We want to back them up to buy stock. We want to back them up to open opportunities for our people. So township business is going to be big. 
We want to develop a database of all businesses that are in the townships. We want to have qualified people that can be recruited from our townships within the business space. So within that context, uh, we've asked uh, uh, Tasnim Modar uh, to be the MEC for Economic Development. She was the MEC for DID. Uh, we are changing her to go there and run, literally run, uh, uh, and, and assist us uh, to ensure that we implement this. We can't pass a bill and then fold our arms. Uh, there are lots of township businesses that need our support.